Hello, welcome back to another video. Me and Dingo are back out in the woods again and in this video I'm doing something a little bit different, especially now that the rain's eased off. It's been raining non-stop all morning so I haven't been able to get out until about lunchtime. But I've brought something a little bit different with me today to use. It's a weird tent, although I don't even really think you could class it as a tent to be quite honest. Um, <laughs> It's just a weird item to use. I fancy doing something different, so I thought, why not? I'm gonna start getting all that set up and I'll explain to you exactly what this weird item is. It's like a tent, but it's not a tent. It's weird. <laughs> You'll see it in a bit. So here are all the poles for said tent, not said tent. <laughs> it's a bit of an odd thing. So there's quite a few poles that go with it. So I shall start getting these set up. It's a metal frame and then you slide the outer cover over the top of the metal frame. Here's the monstrosity. It's actually a privacy thing that you can put over a, a single bed. It actually comes with curtains as well. I didn't bring the curtains with me, but it's got a door on this front side here and it's got a door on either end. Alan's here and he just literally said to me, it looks like a playpen. And I suppose it would if you turn it upside down. <laughs> It would be like a playpen. Weird, funny little thing, innit? Obviously, it's not waterproof, so I've put up a ridge line and I'm gonna put a tarp across it. I brought my uh, One Tigress Limited Edition tarp with me today. But yeah, there was the sleeping accommodation for tonight. All our bedding is in now. As you can see, Tingo's already making the most of hers. <laughs> he already curled up asleep. But I've got the One Tigress Bushcrafter bag again. Really liking and enjoying using this bag. I've got my Flextail inflatable pillow and I've got the Light Tour inflatable mat. I've been using this a little while now on most of my camps and I'm really happy with it. So I'll leave a link in the description to where you can get it. If I remember correctly, it's got a 7.5 R value rating on it. So it's good for winter here in the UK anyway. If you're gonna to go to somewhere like Alaska, I wouldn't advise it, but there we go. I'm not in Alaska, so I don't really care about that. But yeah, here for the UK and probably most places, perfectly fine. I'll link it in the description below if you wanna go check them out. And it's a very reasonably priced mat as well. But now I think I'm gonna have a cup of coffee. 
it's coffee time. Any murdery juicy juice. Oh god, I'm getting old. Oh. Nice cup of anti murdery juicy juice. Well deserved after setting up that weird. I don't even know what to call it to be honest. All I know is it's you can put it on a bunk bed, on the top bunk, on a single bed, and it's like a privacy thing because it it comes with curtains as well. But I didn't bring them. I didn't see the point in bringing curtains. <laughs> Plus they weighed more than the rest of the tent put together. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, nice cup of coffee. The day, what's left of it, has turned out really nice. It was absolutely chucking it down this morning. But the sun's out and we've got blue skies now. So we'll sit here, enjoy this, chat to you in a bit. Ta ra. Get this saw together and uh, go get some wood because we're losing daylight now. And then it gets darker light. Six o'clock, so I would. Anti-murdery, juicy, juicy o'clock. Mm. <laughs> the reward for wood gathering. Mm. Yeah, we've gathered quite a lot of wood, we just haven't sawn it all up yet. Oh, what? We're going to have this and then we've got to go on a hunt for some really dry twigs because we've had a lot of rain this past week and everything is just so wet. Yeah, so, it's going to be a mission. Really nice dry twigs to get the fire going, eh, Alan? Yeah, it's going to be a mission. Oh. Just so, so wet and everywhere. Everything's just drenched. Like you might be in the morning with that tent. No, I'm in my bivvy bag as well, so <laughs> I'll be all right even if the tent leaks. <laughs> <sighs> oh, I feel sorry for you being in that no, I'll be German right. army flex arm tent. I'll be all right. Because <laughs> we're meant to get, be getting rain in the morning, aren't we? In the morning, yeah. Mm. Tail end of that storm from America. Yeah. Hey ho, chat to you in a bit. Ta ra, ta ra, bugger off. <laughs> off you trot with the green Gilberts. <laughs> <laughs> green Gilberts. <laughs> chat to you in a bit. We're going to get the fire going because we want to. A bit of wood wall and the ferro rod. goes.
as you would have seen from the last few clips me and Alan have got the fire going and now beer o'clock a couple of cans of San Miguel for this trip not Foster's not cider oh frothy <laughs> mm. cheers everyone Boop. <laughs> What are you drinking tonight, Alan? I have got um, a vocation. Okay. And it's the um, Sweet Temptation, Naughty But Nice. Basically, chocolate stout. Fair enough. <laughs> I've had chocolate stout before and I didn't really like it very much, I don't think. Yeah, it's a bit, bit rich, isn't it? Mm. You've got to be old like me to drink that. <laughs> it's an old person's drink. <laughs> yeah. Cheers, everyone. I'm just going to. Sit by the fire and chill out for a bit until I do dinner. My dinner tonight, just got some chicken wings, only a couple. Chicken wings are done. Looking forward to these. Ah, oh, they're still really hot. <laughs> mm. Cooked on the open fire, you can't beat it, can you? Better than doing them in the oven or something like that. I didn't put any seasoning on them because uh, Dingo's going to have some. So, and there's uh, quite a lot of things dogs can't have, like onion and stuff, and that's normally in seasoning. And yeah. Good. Tasty. Hotter than the sun, mind you. Yeah, we want a bit. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to eat these. I'll chat to you in a bit. myself a coffee my dinner was really nice actually enjoyed it how was yours mine was very nice too Good. dingo tried to steal mine too <laughs> she did she did she sat over there she's stalking something what if she's after <laughs> that bloody frog again <laughs> she was chasing the other week <laughs> she probably is but yeah nice cup of coffee before bed so if I uh don't chat to you anymore this evening. I'll chat to you in the morning. Good night. Morning. Got a cup of coffee. 
The weather this morning isn't very great. The wind's picking up. You can probably hear it. And I didn't sleep very well last night at all. I went to bed pretty early because I was really tired. Went to bed around 9 o'clock. Woke up around 2. And then that was it. I was awake until about 5, maybe half 5. Finally fell back to sleep and then... What's the time now? Been up about half hour. It's 5 to 8. So, yeah, woke up again about half 7. Rubbish night's sleep. Weren't cold, weren't uncomfortable, nothing. Just woke up around 2am. Ridiculous. Alan slept alright though, didn't you, Alan? Yeah, I slept well. He slept good. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> Last weekend you slept all. I slept alright and you didn't. Yeah, yeah, the opposite. That was bloody funny last oh. last weekend. About every two hours I just kept waking up for mm. no apparent reason. But yeah, so obviously catching. <laughs> yeah. I'm a little bit tired this morning. But me and Alan are gonna be packing up soon because there's a shitload of rain coming. Got the tail end of a storm coming, so be packing up in a bit. Gonna finish this first though, because I need this. Coffee is good for me. Who remembers the bacon boy? Do you remember the bacon boy, Alan? No, I remember you. From Parent Swap in America. She takes away all, all the good stuff and even the bacon and is like, oh no, oh no, you ain't taking my bacon. Yes, yes. Yeah, I do. Now you said that, I do. And he I packs his that. bags and leaves going, bacon is good for me. <laughs> Good for me. This is very You're going to be going to the grocery store. The bacon boy. Oh, coffee is good for me. <laughs> Chat to you in a bit. <laughs> the bacon boy. <laughs> that is me, all packed up. Bags on, ready to go. Get home before the rain comes. But yeah, that is another camp done with. So thank you for watching. I mean, I did enjoy using that, whatever it is. It's not a tent, is it? Let's face it. It's like a weird privacy thing that goes on a bed. I'm going home now. So thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Ta-ra, ta-ra.